Are you a young, inspiring music producer looking to get your name and brand out into the wild world wide web of social media interactions? Then hop aboard this new and exciting music producer meme train before it's too late. Sometime around 2015, already established music producers started doing something strange. They started unveiling the magic behind their digital audio workshop antics and producing short snippets of sample-based electronic dance music videos. These videos became extraordinarily popular on Facebook's video players by being spread organic <coughs> organically. In this video tutorial, I will teach you how to recreate the music production meme videos so that you can too become the next <laughs> <laughs> First, you're gonna have to find yourself something unique and witty to sample. It can even be audio you record yourself. You can literally record any sound you hear in the world by using your government-issued tracking device, also known as a mobile cellular phone. Since we live in a high-speed I NEED IT NOW generation with the shortest attention spans evolved to this point ever seen thus far by mankind, just find a popular vine and sample it. I'm choosing this video of kids remixing a song about sausages because children are the future. To download this sample, place your phone up to the speakers or get like a microphone to record the audio like a total noob. I mean, you could just rip the video, then convert the audio into a WAV file, but who has time for that? We need to get this video out before Skrillex and Diplo start doing this kind of shit. Now that we have a sample, open up your software that you make music in. I use Audacity, because I'm just fucking joking with you. You open up the sample and turn it into a synth, or a loop, or whatever you want. In these Facebook meme videos, the producers never talk. In fact, in these videos, the music producers never actually show their work. They just show all the fancy automation clips and loops and midis already laid out. Honestly, you can just lie and make a bunch of fake automation clips. The general public doesn't even know what most of that stuff is. It probably just looks like rocket science or some occult shit to them. Sometimes in these Facebook videos, they only show a section being sampled played melodically in some nice looking studio while their fingers are fingering away at some $666 MIDI controller. They don't even screen capture their DAW projects, it's usually recorded on like an iPhone or something, and when the bass hits they shake the camera to make it look like the bass is extra heavy. But enough of me psychologically projecting myself in front of the anonymous eyes of millions on the internet, I'm just gonna let my music speak for itself. I'm a gay nigga, I'm a, I'm a gay nigga. Hey, so since I didn't really show you how to do it, I'm gonna show you how to really sample a vine. So here is a audio clip of that vine where that guy says, wow. Wow. His wow is really aesthetic, so what I'm gonna do is highlight just that part in Edison and loop it. Wow. 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 So then I drag it to like a, a MIDI clip right here, and then I open it and I check it. Wow. So in order to make it like a sample, you see this part right here is called a crossfade loop. S slip it up like 1%. And what that does is it, it allows the loop to, you know. Wow. Honestly, you can do anything you want with it. You can make it into a Rick James bass line. <laughs> or you could turn him into a classical piano. <laughs> Or you can make him into a new wave classic. Or you could turn him into a basic ass producer. 
Or if your IQ is more than 200 points, you can turn him into a fixed twin. So that's basically how you do that. You can just sample anything in the world. Do you guys have chicken fries? Yeah. <laughs> Now that it's all over, upload your video to Facebook and wait for the organic viral success. And by organic viral success, I mean Mark Zuckerberg is gonna be like, bitch better have my money. For the measly price of $5, which is like 10 tacos at Jack in the Box, 300 people can see your video. For the amount of a Sony PlayStation, which is about 300 bucks, or like an ounce of dank ass fire ass top shelf ass kush from Ocean Grown in California in the year 2015, you can get 50,000 people to see your video. So remember kids, each time you see something on the monolithic oligarchical Facebook social experiment with a large amount of views, remember, someone out there paid for you to see it. Because because nothing is more tyrannically corrupt than a website that controls your image of the self, selectively controlling what you see and read. Remember, Facebook and Google know you more than you know yourself. Thank you so much for watching my video. Don't forget to share them on the social media platforms or share my music if you like. Also, if you want to use my music or aesthetics, as long as you source me, it's cool. So thank you for subscribing and liking if you do that. If you haven't done that and you like it, I, I hope you I hope you like it. I I I my mixtape is coming out soon. It's not a mixtape, it might actually be a full lengthy play because it's a lot of tracks that I've been collecting for a while. So I hope that you can buy it. And remember, Frank Jeffsy is extraordinarily indie, so if you want to support me and invest in my career, just buy my music.